Hey everybody, Larry Lawton here. I got a good video for you today. I have a reacts video on some court cases, police stuff. I didn't see this, you're gonna see it with me, and we are going to react. This is gonna be a lot of fun. Before I get started, please check me out on all my social programs. Check my cigar out, check out Oliva. They're great partners and, and, and we're having a great time doing this. So, I'm gonna jump right into this one. This should be fun. It's a bunch of little ones. I don't know what's coming, and we're gonna find out together. Well, please stand. Okay. The last 25 years of his life, much of it in prison, has all led up to this moment. Uh oh. In the District Court of El Paso County, Texas, 409th Judicial District, the state of Texas versus Daniel Villegas, number 94009328. Verdict form B. We, the jury, find the defendant, Daniel Villegas, not guilty of. Not guilty. He was in for 25 years. They got a retrial. All I'm going to say is this. I can understand why the dude is collapsing. I feel so good for him right now. Look, I got just chills. I really did, people. I got chills. You know why? Because I could have just imagined this guy lived through, and he's not guilty, not guilty. Drives me crazy. Uh, this poor dude did 25 years. I don't know what new evidence. I don't know the case. But I'll tell you what. In these cases, and Texas is a bad place. I just watched a video on uh, Big Herc, and I, uh, I'm going to actually reach out to him. He did. He had a guard on, did 25 years, and he knows the Texas says how bad it is, how underground it is. Wow. So this is, this is some powerful stuff right here. Good for him, man. For the oh. first time since he was 16 years old, 16. 25 years ago, Daniel Villegas is a free it man. Gave him Mr. Villegas, you have been under many conditions uh, in this court. You are no longer under any conditions in this court. You, you, you are free. You are free. Uh, you know, I'm telling you, that that is just a good one. That's a good one. Oh. Whole county history. More than 200 people. 200 people arrested. I mean, this video is with this song. A local school athletic director and coach and a few Disney employees. I mean, Disney, a coach, employees, teacher arrested lodges, human trafficking. I only thing I can say, guys, is I can't understand this one. Uh, whatever it is, and you guys sent me this, and I don't like to look at them first. But we are going to uh, let this... Oh, my main man, Grady Judd. Eddie Judge yeah, Crazy Sheriff, Sheriff from Polk County. County. This is where it's at. Some of the suspects brought weapons or drugs with them to the undercover location. They some had drugs and, and whatever. I can't understand too well. I don't know you guys can as well. All I can know is Sheriff J.D. Grudd, Polk County. No joke. You don't want to go there. And anything to do with human trafficking uh, is crazy. I mean, I don't know the whole case, and there's a lot of people on this case, I'll tell you that. So, and what do they mean? Did they just bring them in for slaves? I don't know. It's a tough one, guys. So. 219 arrests all over. Look at that. From California. All right, next one. Okay, we're in a county jail of some sort. It's definitely a county jail. Okay, now this is this, this guy getting taken out of his cell. And, oh, 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 did you see that, people? He threw himself over the thing. He threw himself over the rail. Now, why would he do that? I mean, does he want to die? I mean, I, the way he's not going to die from that. But why would you do that? I mean, you know you're being recorded. You know you're going to show the cops didn't do anything. And... You can look at that one again, rewind it. It is just wild, that one. I don't get this one. This next one, wow. I'm looking at cells, or it looks like I was a riot underway, blocked up cells, the whole works. Let's see what's going on here. All right, oh, look at this. Look at this, guys. They're passing stuff from cell to cell. This is what we did in the inside, actually. And they're going from cell to cell. 
and it can go all around. We used to call these kites. You can actually put telephone lines and call them as well. Here they can leave them there, I guess, but I mean, someone's gonna see what's going on. Y'all, look at these fucking jail spoons. Now, now what is this do. next one here? Uh, don't go to jail? You bend these bitches like uh, this? Jail something with shoes? I don't and know. Man. These, these are quick and hit me, and I'm liking that. So, let's see what this one is. Inmates drag unconscious self, tell me into the toilet. Oh, he might be so f***ed up, that, uh, so messed up. They're putting him in the toilet, why? Maybe make him throw up? Oh, now what are they just messing with the guy? That's terrible, man. I, I, you think that's, I think this is so stupid. Dude, this is some kind of weird county jail. Look at this guy. Oh, oh, that's one of those, uh, oh, man, that is cool how he did that. That's got one of those jumping things, man. What is that? That is crazy. <laughs> I'm loving that. What is that, man? This is crazy. Suspects drops, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, he dropped out of the ceiling. I saw one of these once. That is crazy. Yeah, he went into this bank, and he dropped out of the bank, and the police was just sitting there. Oh, is that funny? Now he's in a, uh, not a good move. You know, you'd think somehow you'd figure no. something better out than that. But, come on, guys. I mean, he, you got him already, cops. You got him. He ain't going anyway. He's cuffed up. Put your gun away, officer. Gun is not needed. Okay. Guys hitting NFL bets in jail. Wow, look at him. Are you seeing this? He's betting with his bookie on the streets, which this I did myself. Totally did myself. But he wins all of these bets. Yeah, he does have to get it down, and he has to set it down. That is exactly what's going on here. $1,500 on a parlay? If he put, the middle he won him. A man dressed in uh oh, black here's another one. Shop on his fight back and gets robbed. down El Monte's Main Street holding an empty cardboard box. Okay, what is this Seemingly guy do? out of nowhere, he whips out a can of bear spray and fires oh, it directly into the Oh, he just hits this guy with bear spray in the face. Mesa's you see that? Store. Moments now later, it goes in, look. Inside. They can't get him. Look at this. A bunch of people. Members who oh, look at this. Action, trying to wrestle a weapon look, out of his get hand. this guy. They got then five guys on this guy. Huge, man. But they got to get him. Hit him in the knees, man. The showcase. He already and ruined him. Stop. That he was one of those guys that you got to fight back. You got to hit him in the knees. You know, when he's big, you got to hit him. You got to take him down. In back of him. And my reaction was like, lock the door. So no one lock the door. Of course you lock the door. But you think they can't get through it? Look at them. Hitting this guy with, with, with a, like a bat. Hands. He had pepper spray. It wasn't normal pepper spray. It was bear pepper spray. He had bear pepper. They can't, they can't get this guy. This is crazy. Now they got him down, they can't keep him down. I didn't know what to do. My eyes, my body was hurting a lot, it was burning. I can't believe this guy is this big. Look, he's up again. Look, they're hitting him hard with sticks. Outside, another family member recorded. Look, he's gonna get out. Look at this, the guy got out. Oh man, he's fat. They're trying to keep him in. Look, he took his shirt off. Look at him, he's naked. He's got bigger boobs than any girl I know. A day later, you can still smell and almost taste that pepper spray. You can see it staining some of this broken glass. Oh, they ruined the place. Glad it was on video for them. But crazy. We used to work day and night. And just. Someone to come and grab your stuff. It's not fair. All right, listen. A lot of these aren't fair, lady. Say this that happens. The result of years of hard work and I'm not. I'm not. Believe me, guys. You all know I don't believe in this anymore. About three weeks ago. Look at this so guy he getting them. Here, here, they got his picture. They don't get this guy. He seemed so suspicious. They kept pictures of him. We compared the picture from yesterday and the picture from the, three weeks it, ago. Is the same of course, guy. it's the same guy. Who do you think it was? The same tattoos and everything. The family is grateful that everyone is safe and that the suspects attempted smash. And grab was oh my God! Dude, why didn't they, they just bash him in the knees? At a higher level. Man, look at them try we it. Taxes. It would be a shame if anything happened to, to them for hitting them. We you gotta do what they did. Gotta do it. Anything like this, and um, you know, we just want laws to protect us, to protect the business, to protect regular uh, citizens. I spoke to a lieutenant with El Monte Police. He said more and El more Monte federal Police. business owners Where is appear El Monte? to be fighting back like this against would-be robbers. He said the video that was taken is incredibly helpful for their investigation, and they have you some very solid leads, but no arrest nah. has been made. 
yet. Well, that's pretty helpful. Reporting too, from but... Atlanta, I'm Chelsea Edwards, Fox 11 News. Fox 11. Oh, a new one. Oh, people look at look, the cops at the door. Oh, you know, Atlanta, do you, do you ever see like Go to the va- oh, my predator. She's the. Like... Big drink bottles, break traffic, burp. Oh, yeah. Hi. They call. They, uh, they call. It's, 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 well, it's so happened though, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just, um, the whole point, I just want you guys to come over and talk to her. I mean, I just want her to realize what this was. I mean, in reality, it's not much you guys can do about it, is it? I mean, she could probably get charged with child porn. Who, she can? Mm-hmm. She's 11 years old. She's creating it, right? She's 11 years old. It doesn't matter. He's still making porn. No, she's not. She's being manipulated by a grown-ass adult on the Is internet. she taking pictures, though? You guys have a nice seat. Okay. Um, Thank you for coming. Are you serious? Have a nice seat. Are you kidding me? Matt, man, watch how I put it together, man. That one was weird. I already got the, you know what I'm saying? Oh, got yeah. Point right now, already ready. You oh, yeah. It? Wait, oh, put yeah. Put thing together right quick. Uh oh. This guy's now in jail. What's he doing? Okay. Look at him. He's making his own getaway clothes, if you want to call it that, man. He got himself a. Look at this dude. He, he's sporting his little, like, uh, cut off hook, like, they. <laughs> oh, that's what happens when you're bored in the joint, man. This dude, I don't know how he made those pants. Was that peroxide or something? I don't know where you get that. Where do you get dye? You don't get bleach. You sure don't give you bleach. Wow. Only in America. We're in there that long. The dude's, the dude's going to have his own line of clothes before he gets out. Look at this one. Penitentiary life. Barbecue cheeseburgers in prison. Oh, yeah. You know all that stuff has been really heat, kept cool and everything. That stuff's been in his locker for a week. He's putting enough stuff on it so it, you don't feel the food poisoning coming on. I'm about to slap the burgers on the grill. Up slapping these burgers on the grill. I thought, you see the way he made that thing? He made that hot plate. That's a hot plate made, boy. You see it? That's what you do in the joint, people. That's exactly how you look, guys. Cheese. Look at this. All that grease. That grease is good, too, man. You know that, man. People are loving that grease. Look at the bread he's got. He's ready to chow down, man. Look at that with the onion. Oh, I'm getting hungry. That's a double burger, guys. Dawn bread. Oh, that's good. That, you know, making me hungry. Oh, making a food package. See, some states have this. It's called food package. They can send them. But you know what happens? They open up cans, they put drugs in some cans, they do certain things. You can only put a certain amount of package size with weight on it. You might get an 85-pound package once a year. And believe me, you can put up a lot of stuff in that package. Oh, look at them. Piling that package in there, baby. That kid's going to be in heaven. It won't last him a month. (laughs) All his friends, everybody. But everybody should get packages like that. Some have them more often than not. Oh, ain't going bad for nothing. And that's how you do it. That's what we watch. You know, I'm glad it ended on, on a nice thing like that. And it ended on food in prison. You guys know how much I love my food and I still love my food. I think they're great. Keep sending them in. I really appreciate it. That Discord people, thank you very much. You guys are great. And anybody out there watches, join our Discord. That's where we connect and we do stuff. We have a lot of fun. Have a great day, everybody. Please stay safe. Don't go there. Let me tell you about it. That's the best way to learn about it. Have a good day, everybody. Stay safe.